all right ladies gentlemen and apache helicopters welcome to my 2020 blender 2.8 tutorial uh keep in mind this is for like absolute beginners you literally downloaded blender install it what now so this is gonna go over everything like start i want to try to make these like five to ten minutes tops um so i have the uh, screencast installs you could see my boat mouse and keyboard shortcuts blah 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 kind of thing um let me see so let's start first of all go to your preferences edit preferences uh key map change your preferences select with left or right select left just do it don't act just do it it's like it makes it more natural using the um, mouse you use the left click for you know general clicking so that's pretty cool um then after you do that get ready so first you have your cube default cube uh you could either use it or delete it you could press x to delete it you could uh right click delete you could press delete delete doesn't ask for a confirmation Control Z to go back. You could go back a few steps. I'm not sure. I think you could, you could change that in the settings. So you have the timeline on here for, I'm all over the place, so don't, don't worry about it. Timeline for like animations. Uh, this is the whole 3D view. I guess this is why I write scripts, right? Ooh, I'm all over the place. All right, cube. You can select your cube with left what you said and you could go to edit mode from here or you could just press tab go to the last mode that you selected so for example if I'm in sculpt mode switch from sculpt to edit then object there you get it all right now over here you have your properties um sorry your uh, what do you call this now? Transform. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> uh, like scale, rotation, position. Um, down here is the properties. I'll go for these properly. I'm just like skimming over everything. Now. You have your list view of everything that's in the scene, in this window. And they're called collections. You could make more collections. Uh, what else? Camera, light the cube let's give you delete but let's just do that now so to add something you could go here this view select add you could add mesh different meshes or uh, shift a does the same shows the same windows uh, let's add back that cube for the heck of it uh, so edit mode now a lot of stuff to learn. Uh, <coughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna like edit this a whole lot. So, all right. So you have edit mode. You can grab the faces. You use one, two, and three in the keyboard to switch what you're selecting. You have vertex, edges, and faces. So one, two, and three respectively. So you know you could select the vertex, grab it, move it around, face, same thing, move it around. Oh, I'm sorry, um uh, I press G to select um to grab. G to grab. G grab. I keep forgetting that. But uh next hmm, I don't wanna go in the edit. I don't wanna go too much in detail here. So, you have your tools window here. Could show and hide it with T. And the uh, transform you could add with N. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep this one short. This. Um, what's next? Um, let's see. Go back to object mode. You have different modes you could mess with, but not yet. Don't want to get too complex. Mm, I think that's about it. It's pretty simple. Uh, one more thing. 
you could press uh wait a minute um okay you hold down a, what they call this button again button over the tab a tilde to select different angles that you want to view the thing from view your view uh, so front so this view is the front uh, I think you could do it from here too. viewpoint yep same thing view then viewpoint or you could use the number pad like you can press each one to see what they do but uh, one two seven I mean one two three four five six seven eight and nine I think one two three two four six and eight actually just moves at an angle in each direction and then one seven one two seven nine does all the other ones and then shift I think our control plus the same button does the opposite for example one is front and then control one is back yep so that's mostly it next tutorial uh, <laughs> leave a comment and let me know if you guys want me to like cover stuff specific but this is like absolute beginners but if you guys want really want something more advanced I will talk about other stuff but like you have the complex stuff like modifiers not gonna get in all of those yet I'm gonna go into this whole section in another tutorial um, and the tools I'm gonna get into all of these so this is like just a random overview it's unscripted I guess you might notice that not really reading off everything anything can't talk my English is blah uh, oh, oh, you're not supposed to see that that's random stuff that I don't care about myself um yeah that's about it for this one guys see you next tutorial